One of the great features about this car is that you're able to kind of make it your own. I don't have to, you know, mess around with my controls every time I get in the car. As I'm driving, oh, it doesn't feel right. I know when I get in that it's in the perfect location and I'm ready to go from A to B. Become as unforgettable to your Corvette as it is to you. It can learn to remember your comfort settings for the seat mirrors and steering wheel. The passenger seat has memory settings as well. There are two memory settings plus settings for exit positions. If your Corvette has an available memory package, then the seat entry memory can be accessed and saved through the vehicle personalization setting on your infotainment display. This way, there's no need to adjust your settings each time you drive. It will recognize you by one of the two included key fobs. So if I've set my entry seat to a certain location, it will recognize key fob one and it'll put the seat in my driver position. If my husband drives the car the next time, it'll recognize him as key fob two and we'll put it in his driver preferred location. The owner's manual will walk you through how to set up and turn off seat entry memory if you need further assistance. Adjusting the side mirrors is done by using these buttons. This one for the driver's side and this one for the passenger side. The arrows allow you to find your ideal mirror angles. When parking, you may want to fold your mirrors inward to prevent damage. Some vehicles require manual folding, while some have power folding mirrors. You press this button to fold the mirrors and press it again to unfold them. This can be set to fold automatically when locked or folded remotely with the fob by holding lock.